Hello to all my day drinkers out there, I'm Martini Pictures, and welcome back again to Cards Against Humanity with two lovely people again. We're that. Brodog Gaming and Native Potato XD. You probably already knew that if you've seen this channel. I don't really care. I'm saying it every time. All right, close enough. Let's just get started. Fifty percent of all marriages end in blank. The answer would be divorce, but wait, that's new, isn't that? That's a new card. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nice. <laughs> Starting off brand new. If you haven't seen any of the other, uh, pff, fuck. If you haven't seen any of the other videos of ours, what the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> First off, that. That being said, the way that we do this is we have two cards plus another one that is just randomly off the top, making it three. If you can't count all three. Fifty percent of all marriages end in kamikaze pilots. Oh, so. The two, yeah, if they're Japanese. And nothing is guaranteed more than death and taxes in life. 50% of all marriages Stop end in me. throwing a virgin into a volcano. Instead of uh, breaking a glass for a uh, Jewish ceremony, they <laughs> throw a virgin in. 50% of all marriages end in my genitals. Alright. <laughs> How? We're starting out real weak here. Yeah, a little bit. Well, considering that this is an action, plus the Jewish thing. And I know how you like your Jewish jokes. How about a volcano, anybody? Nope. Yay, Rando! Mine was my genitals because ends marriages. <laughs> so <laughs> and it's my genitals. Just, just I end all of them, or you end all of them? I'll end all of them with all my genitals. All two of them. Nani? Click here for blank exclamation point three times. That's a new one too. Yeah. Click here for my genitals. Click here for a mating display. Speaking of genitals? Yep. <laughs> Click here for science! Boring. <laughs> Click here for getting fingered! Oh, woo, okay. Getting fingered. Nope. Is that... Yeah. Yay! Woo! I like getting fingered. Nani? That's a good card. Excuse me, gentlemen, I have a date with blank. <gasps> oh my god. I have a good card that goes along with it. It might not win. But it makes sense. Well, if you'll excuse me, gentlemen, I have a date with Courtney, Kim, Chloe, Kendall, and Kylie. Ew. I am disgusted. <laughs> well, if you'll excuse me, gentlemen, I have a date with murder. Well, if you'll excuse me, gentlemen, I have a date with penis envy. Ew. You're finally accepting it. Pride Month! <laughs> We're finally relatable, but by the time this comes out, it'll be two months. Cox. What? God damn it, I was in the middle of something. <laughs> By the time this comes out, it'll be two months too late. Fuck! <laughs> Who's the new Jenner, or whatever the fuck her name is? Bruce. <laughs> yeah, but what is she now? What is it now? Caitlin. Caitlin. Another K? I did not realize it was like that. Yeah, I'm up to gold murder. It's the funniest one there. Yeah! Everyone, Everyone likes a good comeback story. story. Kim got come on her back. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Everyone loves a good comeback story, right? Yes. Kim Kardashian. In the video, she gets come on her back, I think. Who's OG? Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking about timing. Why am I all sticky? <laughs> Why am I all sticky? Not wearing pants. True. That's only logical. Why am I sticky? Poorly timed Holocaust jokes. Was I spat on by the public, or was I just snotted on by Jewish people with their large noses? That's a stereotype, right? And them, you know, melting in front of me. Yikes. <laughs> All I imagined when you saying that is Raiders of the Lost Ark just- <laughs> Why am I sticky? Women in yogurt commercials. I want this to win. That makes me sticky. <laughs> nope. You're disgusting. A recent laboratory study shows that undergraduates have 50% less sex after being exposed to blank. My genitals. <laughs> A recent laboratory study shows that undergraduates have 50% less sex after being exposed to more elephant cock than bargained for. Than I bargained for. Agreed. Wait a minute. That, that implies that you set the goal for how much <laughs> elephant cock there is. Less sex after being exposed to a violation of their most basic human rights. Wow. This one doesn't make sense to me unless they're gay. 50% less sex after being exposed to pictures of boobs. That is the exact opposite. That's what I said, unless they were gay. All of these I have to go don't make enough the sense. penis of the elephant. Okay. Elephant cock was mine. 
Oh, really? <laughs> well, there goes all my good ones. I lost. War! What is it good for? Never changing. War! What is it good for? Telling a shitty story that goes nowhere. War! What is it good for? Gay conversion therapy. War! What is it good for? The Underground Railroad. I like the... Shitty storytelling. That's mine. There you go. Because my, my grandpas, when they were alive, they never stopped. War. It's not about who's right. It's about who's left. <laughs> Today on... Wait, I don't even know. There's two letters you've never seen before. No, like, I just don't know how to pronounce this name. Today on Murray. Help! My son is blank! Help! My son is... Being fat and stupid. Today on Murray. Help! My son is... Catapults. Completely out of the box. Wait, Wait, what? what? <laughs> completely <laughs> out... Completely unrelated. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Today on Mori, help! My son is grandma! <laughs> what the fuck? Yes. My son is grandma. Woo! Damn. I got a I participation point. Everybody's got points on the board now. Looks, this is okay. It was like something about pickles. Anyway. Thanks, me. It's a pity that kids these days are getting involved with blank. Fortnite. It's a pity. The kids these days are all getting involved with dead babies. They're trying to summon uh, Slenderman. There's actually a lot of kids that believe in that. That's weird. It's a pity that these kids these days are all getting involved with AIDS. Wait, sorry, it's all capital. AIDS! <laughs> Ready when I swing duck. What? What? <laughs> <laughs> it's a pity that the kids these days are all getting involved with swooping. <laughs> I felt your hand touch my hair. Ah, yeah. oh, I crunched up my neck enough to make I it pop. Got you. No, please don't. <laughs> so what are kids getting involved in? Dead babies. Really? Yeah. Reality is coming to fruition. Lifetime presents Blank. The story of Blank. Uh, did you pick up for him or? Yeah, I, I made uh, okay. two randos. Okay, then you should be good. Yeah. Oh wait, what's up? That's right. Okay. Time to shuffle. <laughs> I actually don't even know what order they're in anymore. You probably do because you saw I them, but I wasn't paying attention. I watched. I'm very good at that little cup ball game. Well, I was, I was the one doing it. I didn't even pay attention. Lifetime presents Fragile Mess... Linity. The story of a homoerotic volleyball montage. Lifetime presents The Hustle. The story... Of David Bowie flying on a tiger made of lightning. What a good movie that would be. <laughs> You'd see a bolt though. <laughs> Lifetime presents African Children, the story of Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Have you ever seen Dwayne Johnson and The Rock in the same room at the same time? Yes. No, you haven't. <laughs> you haven't. I have. How? You can't. They're not the same person. You can't tell me they are. You spit in my nose. <laughs> <laughs> Only because I I want to see what that looks like so bad. The, the tiger. hustle. The yeah. tiger. <laughs> I was David. I was a Bumby. homoerotic volleyball man. We know you're homo. Pride month, gang gang. <laughs> GG. <laughs> Pride month, gay gang. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why did I pick up these? Because you're a dumbass. <laughs> yes, I did. Yes, I did. Because <laughs> you're a dumbass. Yes, Fuck. I did. I drink to forget moments like these. So do I. And I drink to forget blank. As well. Put your dick in my ass. And bend over quick. And I'll slip you, my dick. It's not like you're trying to say, How could this happen to me? That's what I was. Oh, saying. you were? Yeah. <laughs> I'll laugh if I get copyright claimed for that. <laughs> <laughs> I drink to forget Nickelback. <laughs> Very good start. <laughs> to be perfectly honest, I don't listen to any of their songs, but I have nothing against them. I, I have just love making fun of them. Yeah, <laughs> it's a meme. Why am I explaining a meme to the internet? They already know. We just concluded that you were stupid. Yes. I drink to forget Muhammad. Peace be unto him. That's what it says. The entire thing you just said. The entire thing. Mm -hmm. I drink to forget Danny DeVito. No. Yeah. I would. <laughs> At least it's not Ron Jeremy. I drink to forget him. I already know which one's gonna win. Nickelback. Yep. Yeah, because Danny DeVito has his magnum condom for his dynamo dong, or whatever the fuck he says. You will never forget that. Nickelback's me, but right. I, was, I, was, I was trying to wait for you to finish what you were saying. Good. Whenever you have something in plan, spit it out. <laughs> I think Nate's one away from one. Got four, yeah. Wow. Will this be his first game ever? Shut the fuck up and you do not jinx it. <laughs>
It's a trap. It's a trap. Nickelback. It's a trap. My genitals. It's a trap. Women's rights. It's a trap. Pride Month. It's a trap. Please, yikes. <laughs> when someone has in their bios on their social media pronounces him, his, whatever. It's a trap. The Force. It's a trap. I like the Star Wars joke. What the fuck? A salad for men that's made of metal. It's a trap. This <laughs> is like a bear trap. <laughs> I can imagine that. That's like the bowl. Like and you're in a jail cell and they don't give you utensils. You have to eat it with your face. <laughs> a man trap. <laughs> man trap. <laughs> it's a vagina with teeth. No worse. It's a bear trap. <laughs> no, I, would, I would prefer the bear trap. Oh, you can eat shrimp for not $8.99. It's a trap. You'll be shitting for weeks. Devan, do you mean you took out their shitter? Yes. Yeah. I'm surprised a lot of people actually don't know that. My dad ate it one time. He's like, <laughs> you know, because it's Star Wars and Star Wars, it's a trap. Yeah, that's the only. <laughs> yeah, that works perfectly. Thanks. <laughs> I was hoping it was the Star Wars one. <laughs> hey, what's that supposed to be? Because I look like one of the characters? No, because you're no, the Star you Wars for your first Star Wars. Uh, what's it called? Fangirl. Uh, Wait, well, did they uh, did they already make mm -hmm. the ninth one? They're working no, they're on it. Coming, they're, it's coming out this, in December. This summer, yeah. okay. okay, we had this conversation the last time, and I Probably. still don't follow it enough. I'm LeBron James. Makes sense when I'm one of his shirts. And when I'm not slamming dunks, I love blank. That one is kind of weird. Pounding some puss. Pounding my wife's puss. Hope my wife isn't watching this. <laughs> I'm LeBron James. When I'm not slamming dunks, I'm slamming my wife. You know. Oh, oh. <laughs> I was like, what do you mean by that? I'm LeBron James, and when I'm not slamming dunks, I love kissing grandma on the forehead and turning off her life support. I'm LeBron James, and when I'm not slamming dunks, I love waiting till marriage. <laughs> That's ironic as fuck, because I, 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 think, I think he had all three of his kids before marriage. Oh, well that ain't right. <laughs> I'm LeBron James, and when I'm not slamming dunks, I, I love Emma Watson. I mean, just because of the irony of waiting till marriage. No. Nope. Fuck! I was Emma Watson. I was killing Ooh, grandma. I didn't pick that one. What never fails to liven up the party? <laughs> drug drug. Gay gang. If we had school shooting, I would laugh. <laughs> <laughs> the shoot's not shooting. <laughs> the shoot's not shooting. Livens up the party. I don't know about livens up the party. <laughs> I got two good ones. I don't know which one to use. If you'd like, you can wager one of your points and put it on a second card. I I'll allow it. I know you can do it, but I'm not going to do it. Okay. What's that? It's it's an unofficial rule of this game. It's that in the can. rule book, though. Yeah, but you it, can it, wager one of your one of those and put another one down. Yeah, if you if you have more than one, you can wager a point. And if card. you don't get picked, you put your black card in the pile. Uh, yeah. If, if you're not picked, your card is your black card is just gone. It doesn't go to the person who won it. No, I meant back on this. You lose the pick it up. It, the point just disappears. Like the card never exists anymore. It's like going to the. Uh, it's like being removed from play in Yu-Gi-Oh. There, there are cards that bring cards back from the graveyard, but there are also some cards that bring cards removed from play back, which I don't understand. You know, I kept my eyes shut long enough that I forgot what the actual prompt for the card was. <laughs> what never fails to liven up the party? Teenage pregnancy. That's more lives. We're all, no, I was about to say we're all virgins. I'm like, no, you were. You were I was thing? actually the first one pregnant in school. Farthest thing from. Yeah, I would have had, my kids would have been the first kids of our class. Did you hear that? He said he was pregnant first. Yes. Who had the bigger dick? She did! I do it! So did I. I went for that one. Oh, damn! Stick it in me! Stick it in me! <laughs> what never fails. <laughs> <laughs> what never fails to liven up the party? Sweet, sweet vengeance. What never fails to liven up the party instead of sweet, sweet vengeance? Popping holes in the condoms for teenage pregnancy. <laughs> that would be sweet, sweet vengeance. Yeah. Getting back in your children for fucking you over all their life. I swear to God, if this card has something to do with like broken condoms, I swear <laughs> to God. <laughs> what never fails. They would all go together. <laughs> <laughs> what never fails to liven up the party? The Wi Fi password. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> That's the only way of saving any party, just the Wi-Fi password. Yeah, but what if it's locked? The Wi-Fi password? Yeah. You'd... What if it has a password? It's a pa the password has a the password. The Wi-Fi password is the key. It's the key. Yeah. What if you don't know the password? 
That's what you're asking. Well, for. then you're just a dumb fuck who's hosting the party. <laughs> or what if it's at my house and you get the Wi-Fi password, but the Wi-Fi is shit. We still can't record because of you. And I can't record because you're not fully done setting up your PC. It's done. Then what are we doing now recording PC? I don't have no fucking place to record. Go to McDonald's. They have free Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi password. Is that your answer? Yes. I win. Woo! My first victory! I was thinking of using a different song for the outro this time, so I guess this is as good as time as any just to introduce the new one. <laughs> Have a nice day. <laughs>